One, two, three, surprise! <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, it's Ro. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm hanging out with my friend and fellow foodie, Donald Skihan. And hide and seek lover as yeah. well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited because he is in town because we just finished shooting our new TV show. It's on HBO Max and it's called... Baytopia! Very exciting. We're very excited. <laughs> We're very excited. Okay, so if you watch the show, Donald is a judge. Yeah. I'm also a judge and host. I have two hats. I'm gonna put a link down below to where you can watch HBO Max. Also, go check out Donald's channel. Oh, and I'll put a link down below to that as well. He's got amazing recipes and he's almost at one a million subscribers. Come on down. So let's get him to a million. Yes. If you haven't subscribed, do it now. The video that we're doing today is one that I got a lot of requests for. Today, we are testing kitchen gadgets, part 100. No, I don't know. <laughs> You mean you've done this before? Yes, I did yeah. this before with my I girlfriend Justine, <laughs> and we got so many requests to keep doing them. And then you guys suggested these products. So uh -huh. today we are gonna test kitchen gadgets so you don't have to. Mm -hmm. Let's get started. Donald, pick the first gadget. Well, I think we gotta go big. I feel just for the pure purposes of being able to see you again, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is a huge popcorn maker, exclusively William Sonoma okay. R2D2 one. Oh, 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 R2D2. Oh, he's handsome. Oh, he is handsome. Let's okay, plug in. Whoa, oh, oh, turn him off, turn him oh off. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, Ooh, I feel like we've taken his head off. To know what's inside a droid, popcorn. Popcorn. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Lid doubles as a surfing bowl. Okay. Detachable canopy and butter warmer. Butter we, warmer? We, Mike, can we have some butter, please? Mike, can you butter us up, please? Yeah, butter, Michael. Please, butter, butter. Michael. Only has a one year warranty, everyone, so get oh. crazy for one year. Uh, oh, oh, here's uh, instructions. Oh, they, okay, they would help. I like to go heavy on the butter. Are we okay with this amount? Oh, yeah, I, mm -hmm. I like butter on the popcorn. Mm -hmm. You just put it just in. Just go for it. Stop, stop, stop. I don't think you do more than that. Do not use more than a ladle full of <laughs> kernels at a time. Okay. Ugh. What's a ladle? Uh, that's, I, What's a I ladle think, full? I think that's I mean, a ladle full. Okay. Oh my god, did I perfectly I guess act, this? Plus the stuff that's in here, I think we have the perfect amount. Okay. Okay, Ooh. we've done it. Okay. okay, now turn it on. Yep. Now then my what? past experiences with popcorn makers. Oh look, it's moving! Oh, I, it's getting hot! I kind of think like a popcorn maker is just like a big hair dryer. Because <laughs> it, like, it's just like heating up and there's like there's hot air coming from it. It's like, yeah. Another kitchen gadget that I had to try yep. was these cute little salt and pepper shaker wands. Oh, you uh, twist it, you twist, twist it. it. And then how do you fill it? I presume very, very awkwardly. Do a pop. Oh, oh. Oh, oh we got popcorn. We've got, we got popcorn. popcorn. Okay, you pour pop, you, you drink that one. I this think one. I've done too much. <laughs> Look at the butter's melting too. I don't know if I filled this. Is this filled? Well, bro, Oops. it's all over the freaking oh, tabletop. Shoot. It's not even full. This is very good. I'm impressed by the popcorn making ability of R2D2. Yeah, but you're right. This is going everywhere. Is it, oh see, this gosh. is what I'm talking about with the popcorn makers. Okay. There, that's better. Whew. Oh, okay. yeah, we basically have popped it all. Oh, jeez. Like, oh. Now we need to do the butter. Do, is it too hot? Do you need Ooh, a little more? Holy it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> it's not completely melted, but as you can see, over half of it is melted. Mm -hmm. So maybe a little bit warmer butter, like room temperature butter yeah. when you start. All right, Ooh. so I'm gonna drizzle it over. Let's get a swirl going. Yeah. Now if only we had a magic wand filled with salt to salt up our buttery popcorn. Oh, like this one? Oh, just like that one. <laughs> All right, let's see if it works. Okay. Now, my criticism with this, obviously, that you saw, it's hard to fill. Well, now. Because the hole is so small. Do you think it was the wand, or was it the user, or like who, like who's to blame here? It's okay, like... it could be both. I would say you need a little funnel, though. But let's give this popcorn a little salt. Okay. Ooh. Whoa, Whoa this comes Ooh. out pretty here. strong. Here, I'll show you. Yeah, we need to mix it. it up here. Okay, so I'm gonna show it over here, but look, watch this. Whoa. I mean, it's like it's like one of them sand timers. You must want to maybe do it upside down, so it's just oh, yeah, coming out oh, the yeah, top. No, okay, just like that. Just a little, because otherwise, look at it. It's like yeah, that's crazy. A streamline, like that's way <laughs> too much. Stop putting stuff. it all over the I, table. <laughs> I have bad luck for two hundred years now. 
now. You gotta put that <laughs> all over your shoulder now. Just a pinch. Just know Just the whole pinch. thing. Oh, which side is it, Mike? Pinch over your shoulder, which side? I wanna say it's the left, I don't know. Let's do both just to be safe. Okay, boom, boom. Okay, we're good. Some in my eye. Oh, sorry. No, oh my sure. gosh. <laughs> okay, let's have a taste. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Good. No, it's pretty good. Yeah. Is this gadget a win or a fail? Let us know in the comments down below. What do you think? I think it was a win. I think so, I it's think so too. It's supposed to be a popcorn maker mm -hmm. and it makes popcorn and not only does it make fresh popcorn, but it melts your butter too. It melts the butter too and it looks so cool. Really cool. The wand? That's a thumbs down. Oh, oh. I think it's really cute, but it's terribly messy and it's hard to load mm -hmm. and I don't like the flow. It's just too uh, much. Can you I mean, stop this doing is that literally <laughs> crazy. This is crazy. It's crazy that you're doing it's, it over your kitchen counter. It's, it's usually, you know when people do salt, they just want a little, you know, a little. But this is like Bro, I am not gonna who's cleaning this up? I mean, this is crazy. Right, I've taken this it's over insane. here. Insane. To prevent any more mess. Yeah, wait, wait, I have bad luck again. Oh, good, good luck, good luck, good luck. Okay, we're good. <laughs> but we've got more gadgets. Okay. Are what? you ready for oh. A Always. sweet one. Oh, a sweet one. What is our next kitchen gadget? We have a delightful donut maker toaster thingy. I've <laughs> never seen this and I'm so excited and I found this online. Now I learned that silicon, you know these silicon yeah. molds? They can withstand very hot temperatures because you can bake with them in the oven. They are food safe. It Let's does look like think. just a regular toaster, not like a donut making toaster. Yeah, there's nothing fancy in here, no. you guys. This is just looks like a regular toaster, but I could be wrong. Maybe it cooks at a certain perfect temperature. I'm gonna go like right there and Like think. it's pre-programmed? Wait, really great. Oh, hang on. We why need... would they have a one, two, three setting when you're making donuts? <laughs> we have tips for the donut toaster. Okay, read, so what's the tip? When filling each oh. donut mold, be sure the cake mix comes to the top of each, each mold. Each individual mold must be closed tight. Press right. down around all the edges of the okay. mold. Press down around the outside edge of each individual okay. donut. Press the center of each mold. Are you, I'm not taking this in, but are you? you it's you, a lot of just like, make sure everything's closed, closed and really locked. It does look like it's really sealing itself together, except for this one that has a tiny little hole. Oh my gosh, he's got a huge hole in <laughs> Look at it, look at this hole. I do worry about this tiny, <laughs> tiny, well, fairly bigger hole than the rest of them. I don't have a hole like that. I think you got a faulty uh -oh. one. Oh, okay, so we've used a plain I've box cake. Yeah, I got a plain, I did a vanilla cake. Lovely. We recommend cutting the recipe to one third. I haven't done that. <laughs> <laughs> Fill one side of the silicone mold with Batter. I'm gonna put it on this side. Okay. I just have the biggest fear of like putting raw cake batter into a toaster. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> all right, so look, I've got all the batter and I'm going to very carefully secure this so the outside goes together pretty well, but I'm pushing down to make sure, and even in the middle it said to push down. I just don't know what heat to put it on and how oh, do, you, okay. what do you do with these? Oh no, my tiny hole. Plug in the donut. Toaster. We've done it. <laughs> Place the filled silicone molds into the donut mold slot compartments, making sure the handles are pointing toward the lever. We're doing it. Okay, we're in. Turn the dial to setting number. What? What is it? Da, 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 da. One, two, or three. Number two for the perfect golden donut. And now we're ready to do. It says it's only going to take three minutes. So, are we ready? Yeah, that is not long at all. I'm very concerned. Put it on three. Put it on. Put it on. <laughs> Put it on setting three. I'm okay, very concerned. Three minutes? Okay, let's do it. Are we doing it? Yes. Okay, I've switched it to three. Oh. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, that one oh, didn't oh, go oh, down. Why did it go down? Wait, let me try this. Oh. Who needs these? <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> it's stinky a little bit. Mm, it smells like silicone. Oh no, I'm seeing. Okay. Like I'm having, there is a cake. The funnels is exploding out of that faulty hole. It's oozing out and it's just bubbling out of there Wait, like a volcano. I think we just had like, oh. We're done, there's no way. Are you kidding? <laughs> there's no, there's way. no way. There's no way these are cooked. And this was on the longest <laughs> side. Wow. Okay, we've got Watch hot. out, they're hot. They are, oh. Okay, here we go. They're gonna be great. Oh no. Oh, that's a bit of a dud, isn't it? This is a dud. That's okay, so sad. some parts aren't done and some parts are burnt. I wonder should like even if we put it on the lower setting, it's Do still. Do you want to try a lower? Will we try one more. I know you weren't. Oh, oh, it's oh. steaming. It's all like Are you gonna take fire. yours out there? Do you know what? I actually think it may have warmed up. Oh! <laughs> 
terribly hot, and what? these look terrible. Oh my gosh! Look at Donald! I'm just so sad. <laughs> I'm gonna taste one. It's crunchy. Like, listen. Is it cooked? Huh. It's cooked, but it kind of tastes a little bit like silicone and a little bit like sadness. <laughs> <laughs> so this kitchen gadget, in my opinion, is a fail. I think it's time for another gadget. Oh, I've got a good one that won't burn us. Oh, okay. okay. Happy birthday! Hey, <laughs> happy birthday to me! Okay, so the next gadget is mm -hmm. specifically and only for cutting cake. Mm -hmm. It's a leaf cake cutter. Kind of looks like a fish. <laughs> yep, and it comes in metal or plastic online. Okay. And here's the idea. Right. And I'm gonna let you do the honors. Okay. You're gonna use this part about like halfway down okay. to cut like a good angled slice, okay. and then you squeeze together to pick up the cake slice, and then you release. Do you no longer need, what are they called? A cake slice. A cake slice. My only issue is that we're not gonna get like a traditional cake slice. We're gonna get yeah, a sort of like a- we're not gonna get a, maybe we won't get it clean. It's more like fancy. Slice. Think of it as Michelin. Okay. Okay, where it's like a leaf. <laughs> Bro, Michelin? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, just line it up with the middle, Donald. That's okay. what we gotta okay. do. Okay, so there's okay. the middle. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm pressing down. Okay, and then cut it down like a knife. Okay. It looks and it pretty squeezed. good, then yeah. squeeze it. Oh! And then release. Okay, release. See if it will. Release! Will it... <laughs> come release. out, come out! Release! <laughs> oh, that's so bad. Okay, you did it! Look, I thought, just, I thought I got the middle just, of the cake. I've got look the other. <laughs> It is just curved. Who gets this now? I know. I, I mean, what is it gonna look like? Oh. Try it again. With <laughs> how do you? No, I gotta. How do you do another one? Because it's so angled now. The only way to do this now okay. is to lose and this little edge. And you're gonna lose it. This is wasteful. But if, you, if this is good for tiny people who might want to slice. Tiny you know? people, Donald. <laughs> look how small it is. Who is this for? Ants? <laughs> A cake for that us. That's terrible. Does the gadget <sighs> work? Yeah, kind of. It works a it little. Does, it does, kind of. Is it great? I don't think so because you get these wonka doodle <laughs> shapes, <laughs> and if you still. don't waste it, half of the cake will be empty because it's not lined up. That is just no. Like it doesn't make sense. And now I've got a big lump of cake slice thing going Ew. on over here. So, so it's good for the first two slices. Yeah, you could get two slices out of it, and then things get real wild. Oh, I'm gonna give this kitchen gadget a thumbs down. Yeah. Just because it doesn't really save me any time. On to the next gadget. I've got a solution to all your problems. <laughs> oh dear. Like, okay, firstly, what are they called? These are chip fingers. So I ordered these online. I ordered a pack of two. <laughs> you wear these little rubber covers over your fingers to eat messy chips so your fingers won't get messy. But then in the second one that came in the sa same togetherness, this says thermal finger covers. <laughs> you can use them for multiple uses, not just yes. for eating chips. These are not just a one trick pony. These are a two trick pony. Two trick pony We've and- got two <laughs> tricks. I'm gonna try them with Cheetos. Now when I eat Cheetos, I get that, you know, the cheesy and yeah. Doritos, I get them on my finger. These you just like a little boat. Okay. It just, and the sails at the top. They are like the ugliest Crocs you've ever seen <laughs> for your fingers. Okay, okay, so these are the Flaming Hots. I'm sorry, these are a bit hot. Okay, I like that. Oh, they are hot. I wasn't trying to do a hot <laughs> Cheeto challenge with you. I really- No, they're good. I just sometimes get in the mood for these. So here's the problem. These are huge and I've already gotten the Cheeto on the other part of my hand. Can you see it? And here, here, and here, so, and on this nail. Uh -huh. So I, I don't think that this is enough coverage for no. me. No, you need gloves. I think this is an easy one, right? Yeah, or maybe baby ducks. What? Yeah, maybe they could keep little baby ducks' feet <laughs> wet and dry. Or a hell, or it kind of <laughs> like... They could be Crocs for baby ducks. <laughs> <laughs> little Crocs to walk in the garden and have some foot support. Quack, quack, like, quack, <laughs> quack, 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 quack. I've got another gadget for us. You got another one? Bring it on. These are so cute and I have really high hopes and I hope that these are gonna work. They are Bewitched. They are sandwich cutter and sealer set. I've got two peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, okay. which is one of the sandwiches recommended on the back. And they kind of remind me of those little treats that are already made. Uncrustables. Uncrustables? Uncrustables. Okay. Okay, okay so okay, Donald, okay. I'm gonna give you the circle one. Okay. I'm gonna do the double sandwich. Okay, firstly, I have never had a 
peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Secondly, I have no idea how to do this. So we just straight up use the cookie cutter, okay. press straight down. We got them on top of a cutting board and give it a little shape. Straight. Remove the excess crust. Oh, this is the sad part. And then press it out? Yeah, and I think we, or no, do we keep nope. it in there? Oh, we really? keep it in there. Oh, and then you press and down. And we press together. Ooh. We gotta seal it. You gotta seal it. Here okay, we go. how do we get it out? Look at yours, it looks so cute. I'm sorry, <laughs> that is the cutest little peanut butter jelly sandwich I ever did see. They look just like Uncrustables, you guys. Okay, will we take a bite? Yeah, I'm we're tasting, tasting these. Mmm, sweet, pocket. salty, mm -hmm. peanutty. I love this. It's a great little product. Okay, I'm gonna give these a thumbs up. I Definitely. enjoyed it. They mm -hmm. worked, they're really cute. Just a couple more gadgets to go, one of which, no, I have never tried these, but I've always wanted to. Okay, they do look like children's toys. Yes, now <laughs> online, these said that they were egg shapers. You put a hard, fresh hard boiled egg yeah. into these and they will shape and mold into these cute little things like we have a little fish, a little heart, and they have all these little different designs. Okay. But then when they arrived, uh, yeah. This is talk about the the double the rebrand. Uh huh. Another rebranded gadget because when they arrived, they said they were fondant molds. Uh huh. But the pictures on the website were all eggs. Okay. I have boiled some eggs. These are fresh. These oh, are right off oh, the I, stove. I apologize. They're I can stinky. smell. I can smell them. They're a little stinky. <laughs> so what you do is you just open them up, okay, okay. and they've got some indents in here, okay. and you're supposed to put them in here fresh, like okay. when they're warm, okay. and then lock them. I'm worried. I'm, oh, oh are, they moly? are you okay? Shoot. Oh, great. These did not come with directions. Oh, perfect. So I have no idea how long they're supposed to sit in here. Okay, okay. I'm okay. going to Google it actually right now on my <laughs> phone and just see if anybody on the internet has any idea. Oh, I spelled how wrong. Oh. There we go. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. How to this make? Is it. Oh yeah, that's the this one. This is that's it. This is a video. Leave at least for ten minutes. Ten minutes? Ten yeah. Minutes let me put a see. timer on right here. Setting it for ten hours. So oh, let's I put it to <laughs> minutes. There, I did it. I don't want to brag or nothing, Ooh. but Donald, that's ten she minutes. Got the ten minutes. Okay, Ro, it's been ten minutes. Let's see if this is actually working. There for you. I'll take the little yeah. bunny. Okay, yeah, because these have the most design detail, so I'm really hoping to see that on their little faces. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And I'm then... so scared. I never did this before. <laughs> please work, please work. Ooh. <gasps> Ooh. Oh my gosh, oh, I got a little cool. face. I got a little face. <laughs> okay, I got the face, but no ears. This is so creepy. <laughs> Let's try the car. They're cool. It kind of works. It does work. I okay, mean, that's cute. It's I like mean, a little scary, is, but it's also cute. It's a little car. These are cool. These I'll are give cool. it a thumbs up. Thumbs These up. are actually cooler than I thought. Little. Okay, are you ready for the last kitchen gadget? Oh, yes. So, our last gadget, it's a very <laughs> fancy row. What, what are we dealing with here? I found this at Urban Outfitters, and I got a lot of suggestions from all of you that I had to try one of these. Now, this okay. is a individual smoothie machine and Ooh. thermos, like, on the go. It got pretty good reviews from people. No, and I do like that, that you can recharge it with a USB. This is a smoothie of the future, oh, a tech smoothie. And turns out you can turn it on when the lid is off, so watch your fingers, ladies yeah, and gentlemen. Yeah, and it can come in different colors. Usually I do half a banana, but I don't even know if that's too big. Okay, I'm gonna put this many strawberries. I'll put a little protein in there. Okay. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of almond milk. Usually I do about half. Yeah, I might see. have overdone it. Do you give it a shake? I mean, how do you get all the liquid around? I feel like you need to. Yeah. Okay, ready? Okay. Oh. D -d -d oh. Keep, keep wait, holding. Wait, wait, keep wait, wait. Where's, I can't see yeah. it. What do you? Oh, it's, oh, oh, hello. Oh, it's gone, it's Whoa. gone. Whoa. If you don't have it on here, it's pretty quiet. I'd love if you got like in the morning, you're on your way to work, the police pull you over, and this is going, <laughs> this is on full speed. Hello, officer. <laughs> License and registration, ma'am. Um, just one second, I'm making my green smoothie. Okay, it looks like we're done. <laughs> we're done. <laughs> All right, Do let's see. It. it has a little like sieve. There's like, like a, a little filter up yeah. here. Yeah, it means that even if it doesn't get the chunks, you still got a smooth smoothie. Let's check the consistency. Well, it's warm. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah, it's lovely and warm. That is user error. I didn't use um, a frozen fruit. So I'd I'm be cautious sure. of using frozen berries in here. Should we like, try it? Let's try it. We're gonna test with frozen berries. I didn't feel confident enough with ice. I think if you put liquid in. Okay. And this is this goes the same to be said for a regular blender. If you put the liquid in, it gives it more opportunity to like blitz it away. <laughs> I feel exactly what your face says. Okay, let's try it. This okay. could work. This could be awesome. <laughs> it doesn't even turn on. See, it's like, no, computer says no. Oh, oh, it's doing a little flashy thing. It started to move! Uh, maybe it like auto detects if it's like not good enough. Oh, 
It moved for a second. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do it upside down. Do it upside down. I'm sure this is definitely <laughs> how you're meant to use. <laughs> if you like warm smoothies. Yes. This is the this one for you. This is the one for you. <laughs> and I don't even know if I want to give oh. it a fail because I think everybody's different. Bro, bro. Don't breathe. Bro, don't say nothing. Breathe. <laughs> say oh nothing. my gosh, oh my gosh. I'll keep going. I'll keep going. Come on, little fella. You can do it. Come this on! This is not what you want to feel like when you just want to have a smoothie yeah. on the go. Just like, please, please work. Please, I'd like breakfast. And every day's an adventure. You don't know if you'll get breakfast or not. I actually am quite impressed that it has even got this far. Okay, okay. Donald, this may right be a win. The little okay. filter on the top just reminds me of, like, <laughs> This is the little smoothie maker who can. Now there you go, there's some for you. <laughs> and here's some for Donny. Now if you're eating your smoothie in the morning, you only want a little bit so you don't mm. overload. Is it good? It's colder. Um, just blended berries. Put that on the stove top, that's a jam. Let me just pour without the filter to see what we're dealing with yeah, here. Give us, a, give us an unfiltered moment. <laughs> I can't say that's what I imagine when I heard <laughs> my smoothie. <laughs> oh! Cheers! Cheers! Cheers. To a healthy breakfast. Mm. No. It's like really uneven. <laughs> <laughs> for me, it's a pass. I don't think I would use it in real life. Yeah, so sad. All right, you guys, that does it for testing kitchen gadgets, part 100. <laughs> we literally have been testing gadgets all day that it is dark outside. <laughs> so please go show Donald some love. Go follow him on all the social medias. I'll put links down below to everything, especially on his YouTube channel because he is almost at one a million of subscribers. Yes. So go check out Donald and go check out our new show. Oh, so Baketopia. Baketopia! On HBO Max, there were some cakes the best cake of my life. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, I know the one you're, I know exactly you know what you're talking I'm about. Yes. Bro, I am impressed because you like, you eat, you, you I damn eat those lot. cakes. He's saying, he's saying I eat a lot. <laughs> I'm really impressed because you eat a lot. Way. Also, if you like this video, if you like watching us try kitchen gadgets, give this video a thumbs up, click subscribe, and ring the bell to receive notifications every time I post a new video. And let me know in the comments down below what other kitchen gadgets you would like to see tested. Thanks again for watching, you guys. Bye-bye. Bye. And if you'd like to watch any other videos, you can click up here or over here! Yeah!